what I'm doing here is just showing you an alternative way of rigging a Pro-Rex. Okay, what we're using is a hook like that, which is the mustard pin. It's got that little hook part on it, which is a little hook keeper, which works very well. I've just attached a piece of wire to it right now. I'm just going to finish it off and show you what it looks like. Bend it around here, sorry. I don't have any round nose pliers, unfortunately, guys. So I'm making a plan. So basically, I'm creating a loop. That's all I'm really doing. So I'll keep that in there. The wire that I'm using is a number 10 or number 12, doesn't really make a difference. And I'm just doing a hay wire twist. It's the easiest way to explain what I'm actually doing here. It's not the neatest, but it will do the job at the end of the day, and that's all that counts. There we go. Just bending off the wire to make a little loop. Straighten that up a bit. Okay, I'm taking a mustard fast catch. This is a one ounce or 28 grams. And all we do is basically take it. Stick it in, twist it around. It's as simple as that. Once we've got that right, we can actually play around with it to get it to sit right. Taking the Pro Rex, and just before the eye, I'm just going to give it a little bit of a snip. Remember, this is very crude. <laughs> I'm not working with any tools that I should. Okay, so there's our uh, mustard hook. It's got a very wide gape, strong, strong, strong. Going in the middle. And all I'm doing is allowing it to pass all the way around. Making sure when I take it out that it comes out on the middle part on the top there. So we squeeze him, squeeze him, squeeze him where I want him to come out. Perfect. Push him around. Squeeze him all the way on. There we go. And that is basically what I'm trying to achieve. <clears throat> Here's the jig head, a lot of movement, and there we go. I'm going to go test it out quickly in the actual river here at Spotted Grunter. And I'll see if I can't catch a cobby.